Bayan dulot na rin po ng makabagong teknolohiya, iba't ibang paraan na pong umuusbong para makaiwas po tayo o malunasan pong iba't ibang mga sakit. Kabilang na po dyan, itong tinatawag na stem cell therapy. At para pag-usapan ang stem cell therapy, makakapanayan po natin si Dr. Joseph Lee, Chairman, Men's Health Awareness Committee, Philippine Neurological Association, also the Stone Hi, Centerhead, Fatima University Welcome Medical back. Center. Good morning! Welcome morning to Bago again. Good morning again. Good morning again. Okay, uh, bilang paniwa, panimula, uh, Dr. Lee, um, briefly explain mo sa amin itong stem cell therapy. Okay, uh, maganda umaga again, Carla and Diane. Maganda itong ano, uh, pinag-uusapan natin kasi ito ay parang bagong uh, division at bagong lumalabas in the next, siguro in the next five years. At uh, malamang kayo ang uh, very, very good recipient niyan, mm -hmm. mga millennials, because um, science is going into cellular level and molecular level. Okay. Pag sinabi natin cellular level and molecular level, pinag-aaralan na ng mga sensya ang tungkol sa basic ng cell. Kasi basic life form ng isang individual, Diane Carla, is coming from the cell, di ba? Mm -hmm. Cell muna tayo, tapos mag organism tapos yung system, tapos yung tao. No? So, bakit nila pinag-aaralan ng cell? Kasi siguro, sa panahon ngayon, we have like uh, diseases, like the generative disease. Mm -hmm. Minsan kasi, sa dami-dami na nang ginawa natin ng uh, scientific or research na um, for clinical trial para magamot ang isang individual na especially for the generative diseases, hindi siya nag improve So, they went into the cell uh, therapy or cell uh, biology na sinasabi natin wherein the three basic important thing ng cell ina tinitingnan nila is what? Protection, restoration, repair, and regeneration. Mm -hmm. Siguro narinig nyo, Carla, Diane, ay, regeneration, mm -hmm. di ba? Parang nag improve mm -hmm. Ito ba ay uh, katumbas na sinasabi na later on we will be um, ageless? Probably. Okay. No? Ageless siguro sa amin mga uh, tumatanda o yung mga individual na 50 and above. Kasi alam natin, dito dumadapo yung mga sakit. Mm -hmm. Di ba lagi natin sinasabi, Diane Carla, ay, pag 50 ka na, lahat ng mga ano, mga diseases, makukuha mo na, mm -hmm. di ba? Arthritis, diabetes, Alzheimer's. Alzheimer's, dementia, parang ano, dinapuan ka na. Pero siguro, this cell therapy will help later on in improving the life form of or replacing the old cells. Okay, pero, pero how does it work? Paano nga po ba yung stem cell therapy? Ano po ba yung procedure nito? Do we have assessment sa mga pasyente natin na, o oh, ito pwede or is this pwede for all? Yes. Uh, very good. Uh, kasi that, but we started with cloning with sheep mm -hmm. and lambs, di ba? Sa Germany, alam nyo yan, di ba? Mm -hmm. Dinuduplicate nila ang mga tupa. Bakit nila ginag ginagawa yan sa hayop? Probably they, this initial thing is they're already starting it with uh, cell duplication. Then they took out uh, from the, the, the lambs uh, treatment, linagay naman nila yung mga other substance wherein they can get uh, new cells, di ba? Mm -hmm. Yung bone marrow, mm -hmm. di ba? From the blood. Diba? Now they're using placenta. Diba? Nabanggit ko nga kay Car sa kay Diane, ni Carla, pinag-usapan natin. Uh, in some countries, they use even uh, fetus. Mm -hmm. no? Why do they do that? Because they get the cells. These are young cells. Why do they get young cells? These are totipotential cells, mesenchymal. So, ibig sabihin, inosente silang mga cells. No? Walang kamuwang-muwang. Mga bagong-bago. Mga bagong-bago. Bagong bago, hindi corrupted. Mm. <laughs> Parang yung sabihin. Oh, oh. So, pag in-inject mo yan, ay ilagay mo sa katawan mo, they will follow the area wherein they are assigned. Ah. Kunyari, dayan, ilagay mo siya sa may atay. Ah. So, nakita niya yung struktura ng atay mo. So, follow niya. So, it will grow and mature to the composition of a mature liver cells. Okay. So, can you imagine yung old aging liver cells mo will be replaced with new ones? Okay. So, ito ay injection. Pero may mga, may mga bagong technology na ba na yes. intake mo lang? Right. Tama ka dyan, no? In Germany, in Japan now, they're using a freeze-dry mechanism wherein the capsule wherein they put 
the materials, no? Yung mga cell, uh, for cell therapy nila, yung mga collagen, mixture mm. of oils, the mga ganon, they inject it into capsule, then they inject nitrogen. The nitrogen will prevent it from the degrading. No? Oh. So pag pumasok sa, in, sa, sa gastric uh, intestine ng isang individual, hindi siya nalulusaw uh, kada madali ng mga gastric juices mo. Okay. So pag napropotect siya, it will be deemed uh, useful for us because magbe-break siya into ano, molecules later on. Kasi hahanapin niya yung site kung saan siya naka-assign. Okay. Diba? Hindi kagaya pag uminom tayo, ay wala na. Na-dissolve na. So hindi, hindi mag-work. So they're using this technology now to improve cell therapy. You call okay. that cell therapy. And stem cell is one of the division in cell therapy. Ako may tanong lang ako doon kasi medyo I'm confused. Kasi may mga nakikita ko na stem cell therapy yeah. na pang paganda. Meron naman pang, you know, gamot nga. Pwede, for example, meron kang nararamdaman. Some doctors, they suggest stem cell therapy. Actually, it works two ways, di ba? Nabanggit natin, Carla, Dayan kanina, di ba? Either you, you look it on the aesthetic side, that's good, di ba? You look it on the medical side, it's good for the generative disease, no? So, kung ikaw ay isang individual, sabi mo, anong edad ba ako pwede? Pag bata ka pa, if you think, uh, it, sometimes see, you can afford to do that. Preventive. Pwede, preventive, ito. pwede yan. Lalo na if you have a history of uh, the family na maraming sakit, di ba? Alam, natakot ka, pwede yon. On the hind side, aesthetically, it will improve you, di ba? Kasi may improve yun. Kasi remember, you will have additional young cells, okay? Mm -hmm. For people who are aging and maturing, it will help them because it prevents more complication of degenerative diseases. Okay, for instance, meron akong diabetes, meron akong Alzheimer's, magagamot ito ng stem cell, to? Um, pwede, kasi yung Alzheimer's mo hindi magiging ano, masyadong uh, severe. Okay. We're not saying it will uh, cause you, parang it will delay. So, kasi takot tayo, lalo na sa mga Alzheimer's or senal de dementia, na hindi ka makilala mm -hmm. ng, ng lola mo, di ba? Mm -hmm. Even the name cannot be ano, spoken of. Pero pag ganyan kasi, more or less, meron pa rin ano, meron uh, flicker of the parang, uy, parang ano, may normalcy okay. with regards to cell development. Okay. So, improvement rin sa diabetes, likewise with that. Doc, stem cell is practiced na in other countries like in Germany, in China, how about here in the Philippines? Kamusta pong we stem cell? We do uh, stem cells now like PRP, uh, platelet-rich uh, plasma, for some institution and centers. They do it for the face, they do mm -hmm. it for the hair, mm -hmm. they do it for the joints, okay? And some areas like reproductive area okay. in my center. Mm -hmm. um, there are some that are doing it um, for other aspect, de ba? Yung aesthetic aspect, uh -oh. no? Uh -oh. So for the for the face, no? Pwede yon, no? Yun palang ano? Kasi the machine is uh, a bit expensive and mahirap dalin dito. Mm -hmm. Now for the more specialized one, yun na banggit natin, wherein they they use capsulated. For, wala pa tayo niyan, mm -hmm. and hopefully it will be a, a bridge to us. Eh, sabi ko nga eh, in the next five years, I am probably uh, very optimistic. Sabi ko, kayo ang ano, makikinabang, makikinabang yan. Yeah. Feeling ko, lahat ng millennial, wala na magiging ano, ageless. <laughs> oh, oh, ba? Oh, mas fresh ang mas mga fresh, cells natin. Oh, <laughs> Pero mahal ito, Dok, ba? Very expensive ang stem cell therapy. Oh, of course, now. Mm -hmm. Now, because it's a new thing, oh. it's a new uh, innovation, it's a new dimension in the science. Almuta uh, uh, ay yung parang ano natin album natin, no? Pero maganda siya siguro later on, wherein when everybody is ano into it, de ba? Ganon naman ang science eh. Kung lahat meron na, eh medyo mas magmumura na siya. Pero pag bago pa lang. At when you deem it effective, of course, uh -oh. medyo mahal pa. Mm -hmm. So this is really the next oh, big oh. thing. Baka, I mean, it will. it is a breakthrough in terms of um, the health sector. Mm -hmm. Kasi kung 
papalitan talaga ng mga bagong Bago, cells itong right. mga old cells mm-hmm. mo eh mababawasan ang mga sakit na maari mong maramdaman habang ikaw ay tumatanda. Katulad nga nung nabanggit natin din, ito talaga yung goal natin pag tayo oh, tumanda. Na naman-afford na namin itong stem cell na ito. Na ito. Especially for females, of course, I know you, everybody uh, doesn't want to age, no? Yes. The, the in thing now is like, Everybody is looking for the fountain of youth. Mm-hmm. Meron ba yun? Ano ba yan? Nasa mountain ba yan? <laughs> Nasa Himalaya? Uh-huh. Ano? Pero I think we will have uh, later on substance that are taken down and studied and uh, grouped together mm-hmm. na pwedeng ma-consume ng isang uh, individual, lalo na tayo, na magiging ano tayo, ageless. Okay. In terms of safety, very, yes. very safe yes. naman ito. Yes. Do. Okay. So, um, yung mga, ano-ano ba yung mga sakit na posible pang uh, mabawasan ng complications, um, um, Dr. Lee? Kasi aside from aesthetic, syempre, oh, mahalaga oh, pa rin talaga yung, yung kalusuga right. natin. Well, we mentioned Alzheimer's, diabetes. What are the other examples na maaaring mga... Ma- yung mga yung arthritis, mm-hmm. yung mga ano natin, uh, mga heart problems, no? Mm-hmm. Especially congenital that can can be degenerative in nature. Sa brain kasi yung senile dementia, Alzheimer's, ano pa ba? Sakit din natin yung mga ano, yung uh, chronic failures, di ba? Mm-hmm. Yung mga bigla na lang hindi na magpa-function. Mm-hmm. Even the livers, no? Yes. Uh, pwede yan, ma-replace, no? This is one thing that is nice kasi there are some organ system, Diane Carla, in our body na some, when they degenerate or naging, ano, namatay na ang cells, they do not form new ones. Hindi na siya nagbabago. Okay. Okay? Kagaya ng atay. Kaya di ba mahirap maghanap ng liver donor? Kaya kagaya ng kidney. O, oh, di ba? Mahirap maghanap. Pag yung utak mo, mag-degenerate, makakahanap ka ba ng replacement? Sige nga. Oo, di ba? Parang hanap tayo ng donor ng ano. Wala, di ba? So, when they die and they degenerate, wala na sila. As in, when you degenerate, you, 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 you remove everything, yes. di ba? Yung, yung kunyari sa brain niya, yung talino mo, yung pinag-aralan mo, nababawasan na yan, di ba? So, hopefully, these cells that I, we're, we're studying, no, will improve hindi naman sabing magiging ano ah. tayo uh, bago no That's but right. at least marerejuvenate tayo in such a uh, new way okay well thank you so yes. much again Dr. Joseph Lee siya po ang chairman ng Men's Health Awareness Committee Philippine Neurological Association and also the Stone Center head ng Fatima University Medical Center it's always nice to have you here yes thank you so i'll be seeing you more Dr. often Lee.